So I'm Marcus Lowry. I'm uh, with the Teen Services Coordinator for Ramsey County Libraries. Supernatural books are insanely popular with teens these days, so I try to collect uh, you know, hundreds of titles whenever they come out. I think Twilight kind of kicked it off where everyone got really excited. Hunger Games was maybe even more popular. Um, and so there's just been great, great books uh, coming out the past couple of years. Well, I brought two today. Uh, I've got The Infects. Uh, by Sean Bowden. I, what I like about a great supernatural book that also has a little sense of humor, sometimes they can get a little grim and dark and despairing. And so uh, the infects is you think it's one going one direction, zombies show up, there's a, a guy who's working at a chicken factory and people start to get infected, he's not quite sure what's happening, and then he's sort of sent to sort of a reform school and on his uh, break the counselors start to turn and that you know he has to kind of save the day. Uh, but there's some really, really, it's really funny. And I'm not going to give it away because then you have to read it. The, the whole concept, the ending is phenomenal. Never in a million years would I thought like what what was really maybe going on, and so that's why I, I sort of it feels like a new classic. Like it's really smart, it's funny, it's a great. Um, the supernatural comes in, and then the ending is killer. The infects, Sean Bowden. I think people are always interested in uh, myths and folk and fairy tales and things sort of beyond the normal perception. I mean, I think there's these sort of stories have been around for thousands of years, so. Um, I think, it, I, I don't think there's like one book that said, you know, oh, everyone's so excited about, I mean, you know, Dracula or Frankenstein, you know, some of these big classics. I mean, they've been around for hundreds of years and they have, they still have a lot of legs and people are riffing off different, um, you know, themes and different cultures talk about the supernatural around the world. Book number two, once a year, horses come out of the sea. The horses eat dogs, cats, and if they can catch the riders, they'll eat the riders too. Scorpio Races is based on um, kind of an old myth of these water uh, horses. Uh, Maggie Stav Stavader is, you know, really great uh, building sort of a, a worldview, like a community. There's this island, and you know, that's they sort of center around these races. And there's a new rider. It's just, it's a really, it's a lot of fun. I buy all the materials for teens and so if any teenager particularly if there's any book that they've ever seen that we don't own at the Ramsey County Library call me email me stare me down because I'll basically buy anything that a teen wants it's a really exciting time for for teen books and I think teens really really like the supernatural